Hey YouTube, what is going on? Brandon here with another print quality test video. And today we've got the Canon Maxify GX7021. We're gonna be printing off a regular double-sided document. Then we'll be printing three different color photos so you can get a good idea of how this printer handles printing on photo paper. And that will give you a good idea of the print quality that this printer is able to produce. Now there will be links down in the description below for various products I end up talking about here in the video. Also, if this video ends up being helpful, please make sure to like. Any questions at all, comment below. And if you want more content like this, please make sure to subscribe. So the first thing we're gonna be doing is we're going to be printing off some of Canon's terms of service. And so that way uh, we can print off some double-sided documents and you'll be able to see the speed at which this printer is able to print. With black, it's able to print up to 24 pages per minute. And with color, it's able to print up to 15.5 pages per minute. Now this has always been a very highly requested part of the video where I show and actually allow the sound on the, what is being printed so you can hear how it sounds when it's printing and you can also get a better idea of the speed at which it is printing as well. So crisp prints, I didn't expect any different. This is pretty standard for any printer, but now let's get into the photos. So the photos, this is gonna be our first one uh, since we are in spring currently as I'm filming this video. Uh, we're going to be printing out a spring photo. Uh, this is the Canon photo paper I'm going to be using. There's going to be a link for it down in the description below. Very good glossy photo paper. You want to make sure when you're printing on photo paper, you select the right settings. If you're printing from an iPhone, these are all the settings you're going to need. You're going to go down, click glossy photo paper. You're going to click the tray that you're using. I'm using tray one. And then you're going to want to go to after that, you want to make sure it's not double-sided. And then the presets, you'll want to make sure you select everything as far as getting better quality. Uh, if it asks you uh, draft normal or best, you're going to select best. So all of those different settings are going to help you get the absolute best photo quality when you're printing off photos with this printer. Now this is probably the fastest printing speed I've seen with printing photos on any printer I have reviewed on this channel. Also the quality came out great. I'm really happy with the quality of this photo. So fast printing and very good quality printing. Those two things are very important because if it was fast and it wasn't good quality, there would be no point in having that fast speed. But as you can see, it can handle doing very good quality. Now we move on to our next photo. This one has a lot more color in it. And that's what I try to do in these videos is I try to get uh, really, really colorful photos so you can see that the printer is able to handle a wide range of color and do it well and with really good print quality. Now I do have to mention, when you are printing photos, you're gonna consume a lot more ink than usual. So as advertised, uh, this printer usually will do 6,000 pages of black and 14,000 pages of color uh, with the full uh, ink bottle set. But if you're printing off photos, that kind of throws things off and that brings that number way down. So just keep that in mind and always have an extra set of ink ready to install. I never like to let my printers go, uh, ink tank printers go, you know, below 50% of ink. So I'm going to be leaving a link down in the description below for a new set of Canon uh, Maxify ink. So you can get that there. All right, so we are on to our next photo. This is going to be a crepe myrtle tree. They're very popular in the south of the United States and uh, they're very beautiful uh, pink flowers, sometimes reddish flowers, sometimes more of a lighter pink. Uh, but this is a good depiction of the, the standard uh, crepe myrtle tree. Again, very, very fast printing, but then also you have that crisp quality Make sure to subscribe to the channel because I'm going to be doing a review on the Epson EcoTank uh, 15,000 model and this very printer, the Canon Maxify GX uh, 7021. Which one is faster? You can try to guess, uh, but in that video, I will be covering uh, that topic, which printer is going to be faster. So once again, really great quality with this last photo. All the details are there. There's no lines or streaks. It's absolutely the best photo quality you could receive. 
So this printer itself is my recommended printer for the month on my website, bestprinterstech.com. But right now it is my absolute favorite printer I have reviewed on this channel. So there's gonna be a link for it down in the description below, link for the iPhone I used, link for the photo paper I used. So I hope that this video was helpful. If it was, please make sure to like. Any questions at all, comment below. And if you want more content like this, please make sure to subscribe. That's really all I have for today. Thank you guys so much for watching and until next time.